squish down the top of the tube to create bat ears. Draw the face and where the emblem and belt will go. You can freeze this frame to see what the face looks like. Then add color. You can use marker, crayon, or paint to color the whole thing. Cut a thin yellow strip for a belt. Wrap it around, just add a couple dots of glue here and there to put it on so you don't have a big gluey mess. Then cut a tiny yellow oval for the Batman emblem and draw a tiny little Batman symbol on the tiny oval. Draw a few details on the belt, just a dot of glue to add the emblem to his costume. You can cut white eyes to glue on the face. Try and cut them in the shape of Batman's eyes. Go back and fill any missing spots with black. Then draw and cut back wings, bat wings for a cave on a thin piece of cardboard. Cut out the wings, add a few dots of glue, and then you're going to hold Batman to it. You want to hold it for about 30 seconds. Draw a large Batman emblem that is bigger than the toilet paper roll. Add black color with marker, crayon, or paint and then cut it out. Now squish the toilet paper roll on the side and cut out a rectangle. Put it back into shape and see if your Batman will fit into it. Cover the whole roll with black. Then you're going to attach the toilet paper roll to the bat wings with a little bit of glue, being sure to hold the bat wings on the toilet paper roll just like you do with Batman. Take yellow paper, draw an oval, fold it in half so you get two yellow ovals. Trace around the edges for a black outline and then draw a tiny Batman symbol on each of the ovals. And then you will glue them to the bat wings. You've made Batman and a Batmobile. Congratulations.